Are you fucking serious? What the fuck was that? Ah, oh, shit. That was just the execution style. Like I said, we're taking this bitch over. I'll come back here every fucking day. Hello everyone, welcome back to DOJ. Jumping in here doing some criminal civilian, not exactly sure yet, but we are doing chopper motorcycle. These fucking tires are huge, holy shit. But it's been a minute since we've uh, had fun on a bike. Wow, that thing sounded great. And that's what we're gonna be doing today. Wow, this guy is fucking reckless. Hey, yo, what you getting into? I'm going out to cruise, man. What's up? Nothing much, man. Just trying to see what's up. Nope, just cruising. We're gonna figure out what's up. I don't know how he was talking with his windows down, but... Or windows up, but you know what they say. Oh, he's pulling up on a major traffic stop. What is going on? What is that, dude? Oh no, what is that? That was horrendous. That was fucking horrendous. It was a pink fucking uh, charger with like some crazy ass rims on it. Anyways, we're going out to crew. Oh shit, we have no license plate or anything. Oh, we are gonna get fucked with ourselves, especially if we're speeding or something like that. I don't even have this shit registered. I should probably pull over and do that just so we don't get arrested. I can't remember why there's no plate. It's, it could have been because I changed the back seat. I'm not entirely sure. But uh, it's just gonna be a ticket if that's the case. So I'll just take the ticket and then see how long we can last without the plate. Yeah, but this thing I was like, you know what, I really want to do like a nice black and red. Fuck y'all motherfuckers, that's why we're on a bike. As long as we don't go over 100, it's just a speeding ticket, so fuck it, you know what I'm saying? But then again, it's a speeding ticket incorporated with a, um... License plate, no license plate visible, which is definitely not gonna be good. But it is what it is. I do want to go pick up some weapons just so that way we have something just in case we get down with some locals or... You never know, someone's acting froggy or something like that. Don't you try to fuck with me for lane splitting, you know it's legal as shit. I like how you can't, uh, wheelie on this- oh shit, maybe you can, <laughs> Jesus. I say that and we almost pop a fucking wheelie on this bitch. Are you turning? Okay. I like the- I like it- I wish the character sat more back like that, like cruise status. Like he was fucking cruising. It would look so much better. You can kind of <laughs> pop in a wheelie. Like, to, to make it look like that is kind of jank, honestly. Because you end up popping wheelies and shit like that. Yeah, we're just probably going to pick up a little uh, pistol, maybe a knife or something. Just so we got some stuff in case we get down with some locals. Or like I said, someone wants to act crazy. Uh, we'll just do the little SNS pistol, which actually has a good sounding uh, file to it, which is nice. And a knife. Perfect. There we go. We got a little bit of backup. Thanks, Ronald. Even though you change every day, whatever your name is. I don't presume anyone's gonna fuck with us. But just in case. We're part of a uh, elite biker gang called the Camos. That's definitely not it. But I was like, this is a pretty sick-ass vest. And it's a cool way to show off um, the tattoos that I was able to get on that didn't overlap, surprisingly. I wish I could have added more... You know what? That's what I can't do. We're gonna go get a tattoo really quick. Because I have this character saved. Ah, fuck you. We have this character saved, so I can add more tattoos, and if we fuck up, we just respawn the one that we, uh... already saved. It should be quite simple, and there's a tattoo shop right here. You know, bikers always gotta go get new tattoos. All the time. I wish we could lock our car. But I don't think that's possible with this. We could try. I don't know if that's gonna be possible. Yeah? Okay, V, hold on. I'm gonna try to get on the bike when it's locked. Let's see if it works. No way. That's fucking crazy. It actually locked it. That's fucking cool as shit. I don't know how that would work, but okay. That, that works for me. I'm gonna go get some tattoos. So I'm gonna just double check and make sure we actually have this guy 
uh, saved. I think I saved it under 73. Just to be uh, safe, I'm going to go under 71 just to save it. I believe he's saved, though. I think I did this because I liked this character. Um, yeah, that's going to be him. So now we can go to the tattoos. And we've got to get that right arm some love. So, damn, a full sleeve. Yeah, that works for me, even though I don't really like the dragon thing that's going on. So we're not going to do that one. But we're getting close. Let's see, right arm. Let's just go five in. Ooh, that covers up that uh, other tattoo that we have. And I don't like how it stops at the arm there, which is kind of weird. Okay, so... Uh, I'm just going to double... Let me just get some one that like a full arm one that looks good. Which is like none of these. <laughs> that one's not bad. It's not as dark as I would like it. Now his whole arms. Actually, this one is one that I used a lot. 34. I love that one. Because it shows it on just the... Uh, I think like 34 and a 27. Watch this. Wow, it's so weird how his arm was... So 34. I want something on the top. That's not it. Ooh, the all-seeing triangle. We could do that. No, but it has to be something more. A smiley face on the hand. I wish there was something that went in the front. 34 is definitely what I want. Ooh, I like 38. 34 and 38. 34 and 38. 34, 38. We're breaking down barriers. 34, 38. At least I hope that's it. I know 34 for sure. 34... Oh, yeah, I like the red in that. That looks fucking amazing. Okay, we brought him to life a little bit more with his tattoos. This guy looks fucking sick now. So now we're going to go back to uh, 72. It might have been 71, but that's fine. I, I don't mind if I have a few of this guy. Oh, yeah, tattoos are looking sick, dude. You can tell his left arm was done a long time ago, and the right arm was done just right now. Looks so fresh. Fucking car's locked. Or my bike. We're gonna pull this way. I'm gonna stop at the, uh... What the fuck is that? It looked like it had, like, a ding on the door or, like, some type of badge that I've never seen. I'm gonna get a beer or something. Oh, that cat that was laying there. Gotta love it. I love that I can lock my bike. Oh, that's so good. That is so good. Actually, the beer would be in the container. Hey, Harold. How's it going, man? Okay, we got ourselves a burr. We're gonna go ahead and just get this. Uh, slash me. Buy his beer. I don't know how I'm gonna do this with a uh, helmet on, but fuck it. We're gonna go ahead and make it happen. I don't give a fuck. You can have a beer. Oh, wow. <laughs> you know what? I bought the one special helmet where you could drink beer through it, okay? That's pretty much what it boils down to. And that one beer isn't going to get me drunk enough to uh, alter my driving, so... They go fuck themselves. Police ain't going to get me on shit. Alright, I'm going to throw that beer on the ground because fuck it. We don't give a shit if we have... Oh, my God. That, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to lock myself off my own fucking bike and shit. Come on, let's go. Let's go down to where all the bikers hang out. I'm gonna shoot some guns off at, uh, Stab City. We do have some guns. But that's where all the bikers go. Oh, hopefully we don't piss anyone off, because that would not be good. Have, like, a mass shootout. Wait, maybe that- maybe that could be, like, a rival gang? I don't know if I should do that right now, then. We're gonna go down there and see if I piss anyone off, first of all. They start, like, shooting at me or anything. I don't know, that's a cop. Looks like a truck, but I don't think. Could be a ram, but I highly doubt it. This thing sounds so good. And I like the uh, bikes where the handlebars are super high. It makes it look so much better. Oh, wow, I almost dinged my head on that fucking sign. Yeah, speeding tickets isn't going gonna, isn't gonna to be too much of a big deal. That was super jank. Not if we're heading into Stab City as well. That's our territory. They don't want to follow us there, even though they totally will. They'll take us down. 
Oh, cruising on the bike is so nice, though. Especially when there's you're not being chased by the police. Oh, I'm gonna beat you. I'm gonna beat you. Okay, that's gonna get a little sketchy. Sounded like someone was trying to catch up to me, but I don't think uh, that was the case. Alright, let's go ahead and shoot off into the bay before we lose all nighttime or daytime. Well, let's park right here. I'm gonna face out the other direction. That way we can bounce in case we need to. Let's go ahead and test the waters legitimately. Let's get out there really quick. We'll see if we'll piss off all the locals. Yep, it's gonna be a gang fight. It's gonna be a gang fight between me and the locals. This is my turf, damn it. Damn, I just fucked your dog up. What you gonna do about it, bitch? This is my turf. Back up. That's what I thought. Y'all ain't shit. What is that symbol over there? Why is it a bike symbol? Oh, is that like a... The motorcycle club? Clearly, but I don't... Why Why would it have it marked on the map if you can't even go inside of it? What the fuck? I don't know if anyone heard that because it's the SNS pistol. Usually those are relatively quiet. I guess we'll just have to take over this compound. We're going to have to see if anyone's here. Let me see if we can actually shoot these bottles too. Nice. Damn, that's such... Such small rounds, there's nothing in it. We gotta get a bigger gun. Fuck this shit. I'm gonna go visit the gun guy. It's this guy that lives in this trailer right here. He's a good guy. Tells me all my guns. I'm gonna trade in this gun for that gun, though. Hey, man, I need some sketchy-ass guns that are probably gonna get me in some major trouble. Trade you for this small-ass SNS pistol. It's cool, but... Not doing what I need. What do you got? What do you got? We got a pistol MK2. What the fuck is that? That sounds weird. Uh oh. Oh shit. I pissed him off. Pump shotgun. Oh, he's running in here. He's running in here. He's running in here. Stay the fuck out or I'm gonna kill you. That gun sounds good. Was not expecting to have a quick shootout. I don't know if anyone's hearing this shit, but... If they are, they're probably wondering what the fuck's going on. Why? Oh, the pump shotgun's the one that sits in the, the cop car, that's right. Alright, we got a sawed off and uh, a heavy pistol. So we're switching it up a little. Instead of what the cops use all the time, we got ourselves a... You know, I might as well take his gun. Fuck it. You stupid ass. Give me your gun. That was just the execution style. Like I said, we're taking this bitch over. I'll come back here every fucking day till every one of you are dead, you hear me? Motherfuckers. There better not be anyone else. I'm gonna do one more quick little sweep, make sure there's no one else left. I'm not, I'm talking about animals, all that shit. We'll just take them all out. Oh, those are the old animals that we already took out. Nope, we're good. Oh yeah, this guy's a killer. That's what I'm saying. We've got to we got to make sure we uh, take over the territory. Like these, the bikers that like to bike up into the property here, take them out if we see them. Any bikers we see around, we got to let them know. Like these fuckholes right here. What was that shit? Were those real people? Oh yeah, those are real people. I literally was about to just fucking shoot him. That's not good. Are those... Oh, those are... I want to check their patches. No, they're just... They're just fools riding. Just fools riding. They don't want to fuck with this. I'm bouncing.
<laughs> oh yeah, we bounced on them. They're nobodies. Just a bunch of fucking jackasses wanted to go on a fucking bike ride. Aw, oh, isn't that cute? We're out here killing and taking names. Making sure no one can see us. We're gonna make sure they stay out of fucking Sandy Shores though. They're gonna have another thing coming to them. Oh shit. It is going down over there. What the fuck just happened? I was going towards that. I didn't see anyone over there. That's not good. That is not good at all. There's the two bikers, I think. Those punk motherfuckers. Is it? Yeah, it is. <laughs> I just shot at him, that stupid fucking motherfucker. Stay out of my hood. Stay out of my fucking area, bitch. I'm bouncing this way as far as I can away from the scene. We're gonna calm it down a little. Keep it calm. We do have weapons on us, but it doesn't mean shit. Doesn't mean shit. We weren't witness. We were on the side of the fucking motel. We were even blacked out, which was fucking perfect. That'll teach them to stay in my fucking area. They don't even know what happened, but <laughs> it's like, okay. They'll be like, yo, maybe we shouldn't bike in front of Sandy Shores. Maybe that's a bad place to go. I'm gonna sit up on the berm here for a sec, just to kind of keep an eye on my... Sorry, man, I thought you were gonna turn. Usually people... Turn... What the fuck? This fool is sketchy. Can we... Oh, we can access the fucking shotgun? Oh, shit. What is this shit? Did they think it's me? Even though they didn't even see me? That's a nice device, dog. Thanks, man. Can I help y'all? Yo, if you're down, we should ride some. Aw, oh, man, we were just coming out here to shoot some bullets, man. Shoot some bullets. But no, like target practice, like, you know what I mean? Oh, y'all are gonna get caught up like a motherfucker if you do that over here. <laughs> like... I mean, you're just having a good time. If you wanna join, hit us up. Alright, will do, but... Y'all better watch out. Cops are gonna take your shit. Yeah, go, we're fast, dog. Don't worry. Alright. I guess I missed the shot. <laughs> Cause those are the bike guys. Ooh, I just fuck them up really quick. If they even had any idea who I was, just bah, really quick. You know what I mean? Fucking shit. That pink guy even left. Fuck, my cover's blown. They haven't seen my face. But they know I'm out here doing some shit. I don't know if anyone heard that gunshot, though, now that I think about it. Because, uh, no one really did anything. I, I obviously must have not hit the guy on his bike, which I thought I did. I thought I had a pretty good shot there, but I guess that was, uh... Not how it went. I even thought I saw... Wow, there's people everywhere. Holy shit. There is just... I mean, I don't give a shit about normal people. They could do their, their, their own thing, but the bikers, they gotta stay at the fuck out of this bitch. Just gotta make sure they stay long and far away. I don't want them making shit hot. Shooting that shit. You can shoot at other bikers, but don't be shooting at target practice. Take that shit out to the woods. Take that shit to Stab City. You know what I mean? Wow, there's still police activity over here. What the fuck happened? I'm gonna roll down that way just to see what's up. Oh, it's bad. It is bad over here. I ain't sticking around. No siree. Fuck that. That cop is stalking. I don't know. We got some uh, cops out here that are fucking around. We got a lot of undercovers. I'm gonna just black out really quick right now. Oh yeah, they're uh, they're everywhere. 
What is this sketch bull doing? He turned around and slowed down next to me like he wanted something. You better keep that bow rocking. You better keep that bow rocking. I feel like he's gonna try to do another U-turn. This guy's on some on, on some next level shit. Oh, that person's smashing. That has to be a cop. They were going so fast. I didn't notice the whole time, but I think there's a cop sitting on the side of the motel where the shots were fired. Where I had originally shot, or at least tried to shoot at that one biker. I can't tell. I don't. I can't see that it's a black and white. But there's definitely a vehicle sitting there. I was just kind of sitting here, posted up a second. I haven't seen either of those chargers, but that's definitely a car that would normally not be there. So I'm probably going to turn back around just to see what is up with that car. Turn on my lights here. We'll go ahead and we'll go this way. Come on, fool, go. I want to check if this is a cop. No, it's hard to tell. I don't think it is. It's hard to tell, honestly. I'm fucking hella nosy. I want to go see. I might sneak up behind him just to see if it is a cop. Because you know how great it would be if it wasn't a cop? Are they like, what are they doing? I'm going to park the bike up right here. Kill the lights. I'm going to just keep it right here. I want it to turn off. There we go. And it's locked. Now we're just a nobody walking. You know, we can walk. We can take a walk. There's nothing wrong with that. I just want... I'm curious as to what the fuck this guy's doing over here. If he's... If he's stalking me, or if he was just parking there. And we are armed and dangerous, so if shit pops off... We can go ahead and make it happen. I'm not trying to have a get to that. I want to make sure I keep this territory as mine, but this guy is acting a little sketchy. I could not tell if it was a cop or not, though. It could have been a sheriff unit, that's why I didn't see any black and white. But it didn't even look like a cop car. Now I'm curious. I want to run because I don't want the vehicle to leave before I get there. Also, I would like it to stay somewhat dark so people don't see me full on running. Oh shit, it was a cop. That motherfucker was a cop. It did not even look like a Crown Vic. Oh, you know how easy it would be? Just hide in this bush right here. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. <laughs> he moved. He moved. I don't know if he was looking back behind me or if he heard someone run up. But I'm running back this way. I'm running back to the fucking bike. Fuck that shit. It's not like I was going to execute him. I was going to pretend and be like, you know how easy it would be? Oh shit. And then as soon as I pulled out the gun, he fucking started moving. He's going to come up this way. Okay, we're good. Well, that was sketchy. I was not expecting him to move. Okay, there we go. Let's just pull back into traffic here. I'm gonna go check the uh, yellow jack, make sure no one's at the yellow jack. Get in my cruise in while making sure we do territory stuff and uh, no one uh, takes over the territories. Like, we do have two bikers going around, so we gotta make sure those fools stay out of the fucking mix on what's going on here. They're not a part of any gang, so keep them out of this shit. Unless they wanna join it, but I doubt it. Stop fucking looking at me. Stop fucking looking at me, dude. You think that's a fucking game? All of you? Get the fuck out of here, bitch. Get the fuck out of here. Guy on the fucking motherfucker. I don't have a gun. I got a fucking knife, bitch. I don't give a fuck. Shut up. We're past that, bitch. I'm stabbing him. Is he dead? Oh, you're so lucky. I ain't gonna hurt you, but I'm out this bitch. Fuck this service. You hear me? Fuck this stupid ass service. Fuck it. You think this is a fucking oh game? God. Fucking motherfucker. Stupid ass. What the fuck? 
We gotta bounce. We just shot someone, so... I told her I wanted the beer. I want. Oh, this is a witness. We gotta kill this guy. I don't know where he went, but he was running. There he is. I'm gonna follow him. I'm gonna follow him once he gets into the desert a little. Because he hasn't called 911 yet. And this is a one guy linking us to that crime. <laughs> so let's let's just do this. We're gonna run up on him. You motherfucker. We gotta get out of here. We just, we linked that. We, we just took out the one fucking witness to our crime. I don't know if anyone heard that. Son of a bitch. I gotta lay low really quick. I gotta lay the fuck low. I don't know if anyone heard it, so we gotta kind of find a nice little cutty spot. Yeah, this seems sufficient. Right behind a big ass boulder. Oh, yeah. Fucking A, dude. Took out the shotgun and fucking... Held it to him. Fucking A. I don't think they have... Oh, they do have a dispatcher, but we took out the witness. I was gonna say, one guy did run from the store, but since we were thankfully able to take him out, I don't need to call 911 because no one witnessed all that shit that happened since I stabbed the one guy. Got the one guy that ran out, and I think I kicked the other one, which was kind of bullshit, and then I shot the clerk, so everyone was accounted for. Obviously, people that were passing would have saw the commotion, but they did not see what happened inside that store, excuse me. So we got away with that one, uh, but who knows if someone saw us shoot down that guy in the field. If that was the case, that is definitely not good, but I, I think... The way we did it was perfect. The guy ran across. No one really saw him doing anything. And then uh, we were able to follow him on a trail and uh, take him out where necessary. Which actually we ran him over at first. And then we were able to shoot him dead. Which uh, I guess as long as we can kill the witnesses, we're good. So I'm going to hang out here for a minute. And then uh, we'll see if we could try to find those bikers. But I believe they're gone. Hopefully they took off because uh, if they didn't, they're going to be the next target. Holy shit. I left that place, it's fucking daytime out, and there's a scene still going on here. I have absolutely no idea what happened, but I'm gonna take a look and just see what's up. Cause this shit's been going on for a fucking minute, bro. Oh, I got out with a gun, that's not good. I think cam- oh shit, that's not what I wanted. I want camera. That way I can zoom in and kind of see what the fuck's going on. So it looks like we got one detective, couple traffic enforcement units. I don't know what, how was it a shooting or what? But this has just been so long they have had this shit shut down. It's not even funny. I'm putting this on Twitter. Uploads. Video of road being shut down. For hours. This is insane. Uh, I'm actually going to bring it back a little. Let's do uploads video. Shows traffic. Jam. On Joshua. Road. Shut down for hours. This is insane. Boom. There we go. Oh, now they want to start to clear it up. Yeah, once I start posting that bullshit to Twitter, then you guys want- or Twitter, then you guys want to start getting out of there, huh? Yep, they're shaking. They're shaking like a leaf now. Let's go. You guys have blocked this down for these people long enough. Everyone's a-bouncing. Seems legit. Is there really another call even though you've been there for like five hours? <laughs> like, how is that even fucking possible? Oh, oh, fail. Failio. He just a whap to his acaro. Yeah, it looks like people are finally done. Finally let that shit fucking go. That was ridiculous, man. They had that shit locked down for fucking days. 
He wants it too. He wants it. I think he's gonna try to get in tra traffic and do, yep. Oh, fucking sneaky ass police. Oh, that's cute. That is cute. That's the dude that got harassed. That is definitely the dude that got harassed. Ooh, I love it when you can lane split. See ya, bish. Oh, I love it. He's bobbing back and forth, making sure he can keep an eye on shit. He wants it, but he doesn't know what he wants to get me for, but I did that pretty aggressive, uh... Hour. Oh, I don't have a plate. That's right. Totally forgot about that. Totally forgot about that. Please turn. Just please turn. I'll pull up to get gas. I'm gonna slide myself in this bitch right here. Oh yeah, he's gonna get me right here. I can see it. Nope, he's gonna keep it pushing. Keep it pushing, big guy. We don't have a plate, but that doesn't fucking matter. Might as well top off while I'm here. Oh yeah, I thought he was for sure gonna get me, but I guess... I guess we're good. I don't know where he went, but... Let me see if I can back up right here. I'm gonna just park right here. I'm gonna see if he tries to come and fuck with me. Oh, look! They are pulling people over left and right up in this bitch. Holy shit. It's a nice red on that, uh, Explorer, though. They got unmarked units out the ass tonight, ladies and gentlemen. No fucking bullshit. Holy crap. So we're just gonna chill for a second because, uh... I don't know, I feel like someone kind of picked up on the no plate there, but we were able to kind of sneak out of the, uh... Just, you know, sneak off a side entry exit. So I want to try to lay low for a second, then we can kind of get back on the road here. I see no bikers, so I think we kind of scared them off. Or maybe they went to go shoot really, 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 really far away. I'm not entirely sure. I'm surprised there's no marked unit. Oh, maybe they were just checking out the car. I don't know what the fuck they're doing, but... That's some weird shit. Is that the guy who owns the pink car? Or is that a fucking cop? I see a gun on his hip, but I'm not entirely sure. Oh yeah, it probably has to be two cops. So it looks like those detectives were just waiting for a tow truck to get there. Uh, that's the black explorer that was fucking following me. Oh my god, almost just got in a fucking collision with that car that passed by. Holy shit. Yeah, that was the guy that was stalking me a little hard there. So we're gonna, uh, chill out. I should have left while he was not even anywhere in the area, but it looks like he's going on Joshua, so we might as well bounce out of the area. Oh yeah, he's going left there. I'm just gonna go out this way. See you bye, dude. Oh, he pulled over. What a dick. He is focusing way too much on what's going on around him. Okay, I don't think it was for me. He just pulled over to do his own thing. I was gonna be like, that's some bullshit right there. That guy is fucking Humpty Dumpty. And he is not falling off the wall. So I'm chilling on the... Just smoking a cigarette now, but... There's a cop in there that's getting, uh, questioning some people, which is actually cool. So we might have this open up into some type of investigation. So we might be able to, uh, progress this a little further. Uh, we did shoot down that guy. And so I'm saying, he's, he's asking if anyone heard any gunshots in the, on Marina. And I'm saying shotgun blasts super far away. Like 10 minutes ago type of gig. See if maybe they can connect the dots on a murder. Um... There is a primary, uh, let's see, shit, technically someone would walk into the fucking, uh, someone would walk into, yeah, that's what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do, we're gonna do 911 really quick, yes, that was us calling 911, <laughs> San Andreas 911 was location you went to. Hi, yeah, yeah, I just, uh, went in to get a beer at the Yellow Jack and everyone's dead. Okay, can you give me an approximate number? Uh, what do you mean the approximate number? I didn't stick around, I saw that shit and I bounced, so I just wanted to let someone know. Okay, did you see anybody suspicious in the area? No, man, they looked like they were dead for a while. 
All right, sir. Can I have your name? Uh, no. I just I want to stay anonymous. I just I just want to let y'all know. All right, sir. I appreciate you calling that one. We'll get officer at that location. Any miss? Okay. Have a good one. Good one. Thank you. Okay, so uh, basically, cops will alpha ID that call, and I can give them the necessary information uh, pertinent. I don't think there's cameras at the Yellow Jack because, again, we're in the county, and no one spends money on shit like that. Um, but the dots are coming together, so let's see if they can actually connect them. Actually, a pretty cool looking car. Uh, connect the dots and actually see if uh, they can catch them. I totally forgot about that. I was like, shit, what <laughs> what happens when someone tries to go into? Um, you know, the yellow jack, they're gonna see other people dead. I guess there's just no one wanted beer for a while, so... I'm glad, I'm glad we finally got that out, but when officers get there, they'll use the chat and they'll be like, you know, walks into yellow jack, what do I find? And then that's when they'll start doing questions and all that stuff. And then, um, I don't think there was any blood from the guy when he ran, so they're probably not gonna find that guy's body, but at least they're gonna have some, uh, roleplay that we can go off of here. To see if they could try to catch a guy that was, well, that murdered two people. Two or three people, actually. Um, and then has went around doing some other dumb shit. Well, the killer always goes back to the scene of the crime. So we're going to go back and we're going to watch this all unfold. Kind of sitting across the street status, which I think will be nice. And it'll, it'll be like, oh, fuck, who's the killer? The guy that's been watching you the whole fucking time. So uh, we, I also updated the chat and was like... Um, you know, in case they go in there and see nothing, because it's been a while. I put in the chat, I said, officers going to Yellow Jack find crime scene. So they'll have to ask exactly what they find. But at least they know that they're going to probably stumble across a crime scene there, which is what we want. Okay, here we go. So he says, um... Oh no, I'm Ronnie White. Fucking A. I don't know if the <laughs> son of a bitch. I got so confused. I don't know if cops even got to the uh, Yellow Jack yet. So we should probably see if, uh... Okay, I see flashing lights, so there's definitely someone there. Oh yeah, there's major people inside. We're gonna pull off right here. I'm gonna go with the camera, that way I can, uh... See what's going on across the street. So it looks like they've made entry. Uh, let me just help them out. Officers... Find... One... Clerk... Shot... Three times behind... Counter... One... Male person... Stabbed... And another... Hit in the head. Three down in... Total. Now the whole point of this is, is can they crack the case? That's the question. I don't think they saw... <laughs> shit. I don't see any cameras. Bar attendant was shot multiple times. Oh shit. Bar attendant was shot multiple times. I don't see any- there's no CCTV in the fucking Yellow Jack, I don't think. I'll give them what they want, fucking shit, I'll give them something. Uh, male... Dark figure... With a... Mask... Slash... Something... Over his face. Came in and shot. Stabbed. And beat three people. And walked out. I am pointing to myself like...
See, I don't think the CCTV thing is is that correct because I don't think there's any fucking cameras in there. That's the most fucking fucked up part. So I'm going to go check really quick. Hold on. No, there's no no cameras in here. Due to the fact of that, I am not going to, um, I'm not going to role play. Okay, uh, trail looks like it leads to a, okay, you know what, before I do this, because they're starting to actually do good, I'm going to bounce. Because they're starting to actually get on the good trail. The CCTV thing I'm not going to play along with because that's bullshit. There's no cameras in there. Trail looks to lead to a person running and a bike following. CCTV doesn't, oh God, doesn't show good enough footage to make out a description. Also, no cameras inside or bar. Like, if I see a camera, like, that's on a building, I roleplay that the camera, that when what direction it faces and what it would see, not just roleplaying that there's a camera there. Like, if there's no camera and someone shoots someone where there's no camera, well, you're probably not going to find out who the fuck it was that shot him unless you do other type of police work, <laughs> like... You know, simple shit. Okay, he's uh, checked uh, Yellow Jack for signs of robbery. No signs of robbery. Only signs of a struggle. Uh, any footprints from stepping in blood? No. I did stab the guy. I'm stepping in blood. Only footprints are the ones that lead around. Well, what direction is that? Around north side of building. Which look to have motorcycle tires following. Only footprints are the ones that lead around north side of building, which look to have a motorcycle tires following. So basically, they're getting the impression possibly that a motorcycle was involved. Um, finds shell. Finds three shell casings from a high caliber pistol in front of the bar. I think I shot her about three times. I missed once, but I think I did for sure get them um, about one time. Or two times for sure missed once, I think, if I'm not mistaken. Since they don't have a positive uh, for sure that it's me, I'm going to go ahead and drive back out. Examines tire tracks, what brand of tires? Uh, this is going to be difficult. We actually changed them from the custom ones. Looks to be super thick tires. Two tires in a line. Indicating... Some sort of motor cycle. Tires seem to be abnormally thick on front and back. Custom tires so they don't match anything in known. Database 
God, I've been watching too much Dexter. <laughs> Forward's notebook from Pink. Okay, that was the wrong one. Okay, so I'm, they're getting somewhere. That's what I'm saying. That's some police investigation right there. You know what I mean? Just going and saying, looks at CCTV. What do I find? Dude, there's no cameras. Look around. Fuck. What the fuck do you mean? Play it right. Any fingerprints are ca on the casings or does it show signs of suspect wearing gloves? I think this guy's gonna try to pull me over. Damn, they're moving quick, dude. Like, what the fuck? Oh, I do not have a plate, so that's a little... That's a little sketchy now that I think about it. Well, what can you do? Oh! Are you fucking serious? What the fuck was that? G ah, shit! Stupid motherfucker! I'm fucking late Is no one gonna go stop that fucking guy? Poor bag. Fucking shit, man. Where you with? I don't know. I would, why don't you ask that fucking dickhole cop that almost killed? What did he ran a stop sign? What the fuck was that? What was he driving? He's fucking. St don't mind the gun, but uh, he's he's sitting right there, man, in the black fucking ghost police car. Okay. You don't see him behind the fucking Prius? Oh yeah, now I do. All right, so I'm gonna have to do an accident report. So. Well, he didn't hit did me. He hit no, he didn't hit me, but he, he blew that fucking over. stop sign. I stopped at my stop sign. I turned okay. left and. All of a sudden, out of nowhere, like, I, the car there, I, I don't know what the fuck, I don't know. I don't know what the fuck just happened, dude. Alright, let me move, uh, let me move my car real quick. Alright, yeah, because I don't know what the fuck happened. I almost just died. This is bad, because now we're gonna get into some shit. Uh, the bike was not hit. No, shit, it wasn't hit, but you blew a stop sign, bro. Hey, sir, I also noticed you didn't have a plate on this, uh, Those on this bike. signs of wearing. Any reason for that? No, I just don't have one. Okay. You know what, let me go ahead and get your insurance and your, uh, ID real quick. And then... Yeah, no, go ahead, it's Ronnie White. Okay. I'll be right back with you, sir. Man, that was fucked up. What the fuck? What happened, man? I don't know. Ask your buddy. Did he hit you? No, but he blew a stop sign at super fucking fast with no lights on. Okay. Well, the reason we were kind of following you right there is because we're looking for any kind of motorcycle that might be related to a crime scene uh, that happened back there at the Yellow Jack. I'm uh, not saying it was you or anything, but we're just trying to follow up just to uh, take all precautionary steps to make sure you uh, aren't the guy. Well, the guy, I'm confused. The guy said it was because I didn't have a plate, and now you're saying because of, of a crime that happened to Yellow Jack. What is it? Okay, I don't know what the officer said to you, but I'm just letting you know what I said is uh, the reason why we have so many cops over here. Uh, okay. I'm just going to play dumb. Taking your helmet off for me? I can, yeah. I don't see why I need to, but. Is there a reason for me needing to? Huh? Yeah, I was not supposed to be there. <laughs> Tyson yeah, there. well, I told them not to keep going. I guess I had too much tequila, and they didn't stop. Wow. <laughs> so... <laughs> you said fucking fuck me up. I guess. <laughs> I forgot that I did that one, I guess. Okay. <laughs> well, uh, we'll, we'll talk to the officer real quick, see exactly what happened and why he's exactly stopping you. Just, uh, you mean he second. just said, because I had no plate, but he I, it wasn't a stop. I got almost killed by one of y'all guys, so... I don't know. This is unconventional as shit if I've ever seen it, and I watch a lot of cops TV. <laughs> like. Yeah, it's uh, not 
not the way we're supposed to operate, but uh, we'll try to get things figured out. Who was the uh, officer that almost hit him? Oh, not me. I was driving that one explorer. Probably the guy that's all the way in the back over there. <laughs> like... Hey, what's up? <laughs> oh, fuck. No, I haven't been to the Yellow Jack. I pulled away from it on the other side, but I was cutting through some uh, dirt trails over there, and then I popped on to Panorama. I was going to turn left onto Joshua and almost lost my shit. I was hanging out across the street. I was filming you guys for like 10 minutes. Okay. Were you across the street uh, before any police arrived? No. I stopped once I saw you guys because I got curious. Just like you guys were over there on... Uh, Joshua for like 20 minutes. By chance, do you mind if I just pat oh, you down real quick? It's not a search, just if we're going to be out here talking to you. I don't think that's necessary safety considering safety. the fact that you're, one of your guys okay. almost killed me. I think that's a little rude. Right. I mean, it's fine if you don't want us to. It's just figured I'd ask, okay? Well, I mean, well, that uh, officer safety, my ass, that's kind of bullshit. Do you want me to pat you down? It's a civilian safety thing. I'm just saying, don't throw bullshit ass little remarks at me like that's gonna work like every other stupid civilian. Like, I, I, you know. I mean, sir, you already know we're armed, because we don't know if you're armed. But so it doesn't matter if I'm armed it would be or not. Kind of pointless for you to pat us down. You already know the. But the, I'm just saying it. Resolution of the pat down. But that's the thing is, not every civilian, whether they are armed or not, needs to be treated as if they're gonna pull a gun and pop you in the face. Like that, that, that doesn't. Uh, yeah, no. I didn't say that. You're, no, you're absolutely right, sir. There's no reason for us to pay you now. We're not going to. You're, you're, you're fine. Well, you're right. You know, like, I gave my license for the traffic violation because I have no plate. I know that. You know, my bad. Oh, yeah, here's your license right. back. I appreciate it. Hey, man, it's a really nice bike you got there. Yeah, you almost took it out. <laughs> like... <laughs> oh, things happen sometimes. Well, you know, stop signs, they were there long before the word things happened even wasn't invented, so... Well, I know what I it almost saw. I almost really fucking nice. died. Yeah, there's a lot of bikes out here uh, that are custom tires and custom bikes. You know how close we are to the... Fucking Stab City? I was just looking, man. That's really nice. One. That's cool, man. You want to keep admiring it? Go ahead. Anything else? If you guys have any questions considering the fact that you guys are getting a little nosy about whatever the hell happened to the Yellow Jack that I don't know about, you get a warrant, you can keep going. I know my rights. Like I said, that plate, I'll fix it. You give me a fix a ticket, fuck it. If you really need to, give me a ticket. But, this guy almost Sir, hit me. There's no going around that. I mean, I just want to, you know, man up to the shit and be like, damn, you almost fucking killed the dude because you blew a stop sign. You're exactly right, sir. Sorry uh, for any trouble that uh, we might have caused, okay? We're just trying to get things figured out. Like we said, we had uh, some casualties back there at the Yellow Jack. I understand, like, so yeah. looking for a motorcycle of your description. Not completely your description, but we had some uh, tire marks left behind. That, uh, I mean, I got these tires from the guys. The ones you have. I got these tires from the guys at the Stab City. So any, I don't know, man. There's a lot of bikes that have these tires. We all roll with the same shit. So, I mean, like, I, you got my information. If you have any questions, you're welcome to hit me up. Yes, sir. All right, yeah. Uh, if the officer that uh, was talking about the plate doesn't have anything, we're just going to go ahead and let you go, okay? Yeah, no, I appreciate it. I mean, I wish I could help further. I mean, I can't. Yeah, no, as far as the plate, right. I'm not I'm not too concerned about it. Um, you, you're good to go when you uh, when you feel fit. Okay. <clears throat> uh, excuse me. All right, let me uh, yeah, get my helmet back on and stuff. A, uh, we give this gentleman a business card so he can get kind of insurance can get in contact with him. Uh, from what I understand, no no contact was actually made between the, the squad car okay. and his bike. Oh, okay. That's super fortunate then. Alright. Yes, yeah, sir. Uh, like they said, you're, you're good to go. We apologize for holding you up. 
Yeah, no worries. Yeah, I didn't make contact with him, but after that, he made me lose my footing and I fell and the bike landed on my knee, so... Got some blood on me and shit. Oh, yeah, no, that sucks. I mean, you don't need medical attention, dude. You want to call somebody for you? Nah, no, nah, I'm just saying. It's just the whole situation is fucked, you know what I mean? Like... <laughs> he looks like yeah, a rough no. motherfucker. I don't think he needs any medical attention. Yeah, well, the whole face tattoo shouldn't be there. <laughs> like... Yeah, no, not at all. We don't, we don't judge, sir. <laughs> I hope you understand why we're kind of like on edge. We had a pretty gruesome scene over there at the Yellow Jack, so we're taking all precautions. I, I can hope you understand. We apologize for taking up your time. Yeah, no, no, that's cool. You guys have a good night. Too, sir. Appreciate it. So I'm going to say that they match, but that doesn't really mean anything. That We'll see if they want to take us back down. Let me just get on the bike and get away, and then I'll put they match, because it's not right, like it's going to so be instant. Just in case if it's relevant or not. Let me go ahead and get down this way. One of them's probably gonna follow. And be all detective. Are you fucking serious? Get your shit together. Let me get down to Stab City. I gotta hide out, you know what I mean? Like, I gotta be on the low. Maybe I shouldn't go to Stab. Maybe we should go this way. I'm killing the lights. Fuck this. Dude, they had me, bro. Watch, now I'm gonna give them the info they need. To take my ass in. I don't know if that's gonna be enough to get a warrant, but... Crime Lab gets back. They match. <laughs> that's how that was supposed to go at all. Seems legit. I needed to get out of there. Oh, fuck. Hold on. I gotta take over this property. Sorry, bro. Okay, now this is mine. Now I can see out of both window. Oh, this is perfect. So this is gonna be my hideout, so that way we can finish the rest of the uh, scenario with them. They had me, but again, crime work doesn't happen within one second. You know what I mean? Like, you gotta... You gotta go through the processes of... You know, having a little bit of time. So right now, that they have a match, you have... ...something that shows that that bike possibly could have been at that location during... ...some point. It doesn't mean that they were there during the scene of the crime, but it means that they were there at some point. Now, something that they could get is if they had a victim's blood on me, but because I did fall and the bike fell on me and I had a scratch... Again, it's not like it was just probable cause for them to get a swab on me because I have a bike that relatively matches someone of that description. So, all in all, I'm making them work for it. Those detectives, they're gonna be finding out what the fuck a detective is really like. Like, I've been watching way too much fucking Dexter. <laughs> like, it's not, it's not good. But this is good. This is fucking fun roleplay because it, it makes them work for it instead of it being... Check CCTV. I'm not gonna let that go. Sorry, dude. I'm, I'm drilling it on you, but uh, check CCTV. What do I find? Like, that's such a easy way out when it could be so much more. You know what I mean? It could be so much more intuitive um, if it wasn't just handed to you on a silver platter. And that's what I think, especially if you're gonna be a detective. Yeah, there could be people out there doing traffic stops and stuff like that. But I think, uh, you know, the detectives need a little bit more detective work to be doing, which I think is cool. Okay, so this is pretty much a smoking gun. They went down there and said, no one is familiar with Ronnie in Stab City. They say some guy came down there on a bike, shot three people earlier, Earlier, they say, but they didn't want to report it because they don't want police nearby. So it's not sure... Um, they aren't sure if that is who you are talking about. But they, uh, are giving that information to help, if possible. Alright, I'm giving it to them. These detectives are working. Did any of the local witness a crime possibly get a description? Um... They are asking you to 
possibly. I gotta get a little more hidden. Possibly jog the. their. memory on what the guy might look like. Oh, fuck, dude. Someone just pulled in this bitch. I don't know if he saw me from, like, afar. Or maybe saw my bike, but that's not good. That is not good at all. Maybe I could sunbathe on the couch and make it look like I'm not even in here. That would be dope takedown. Let's see if this works. Oh yeah. Fuck, he got up instantly. Why? Oh, they might have... I hear helicopters rolling up. Why is he doing that? Come on, bro. All you have to do is just fucking... Oh, here we go. Here's a bed. Try this again. There we go. Okay, so make it just looks like... The, that would be a dope ass fucking uh, takedown. Like, like they check the property. I'm just laying down and you know, like taking a nap. And they're like, "Sir, we have a warrant for your arrest." Like that would be fun detective work. You know what I mean? No shootout. No nothing like that. You know, obviously we had a shootout prior, but let's see if there's anything in any of the locals at Stab City witness any crime. They're not playing along the way I want. They're they're just asking for it. I want them to be like, did you happen to see a guy? The locals are asking you to help them remember. A lot of guys come in here. The guy they saw fleeing after the shooting which they didn't witness the shooting had some sort of vest unknown unknown color and helmet. Possibly tattoos on arms, or it could have been dirt. I don't think the, yeah, the back property isn't them. Yellow Jack owner says the top property is not his. You must contact. Uh, let's see what's my name. Number three five six to get their permission. Did the people at Stab City see the individual leave on a red custom motorcycle? Um, locals at Stab City saw a copper style bike, but couldn't make out any colors since it was nighttime. This is fucking roleplay. Damn, dude, we are getting it right now. This is fucking dope. They're gonna find me just sleeping too, which is great. 
I want to just be caught sleeping. That would be so cool to just, you know, not... Not have it be a shootout or anything like that. Just some relaxed ass fucking... Like, that's detectives working hard. I don't know if they... I don't know why they're here so quick, though. Because detectives are working. I'm gonna... Once they try to contact me, I'm gonna say, I'm sorry, unless you have a warrant. I don't want anyone in my abandoned building. You know what I mean? Like... Oh, this is fun. Because I want them to have a warrant before they come in here. You know what I mean? Um, yellow or Ace Liquor. Oh, no. Ace Liquor owner. Shit. Says top property. Fuck. Isn't owned by them. You must contact three... Five, six, and ask for Janet. She owns the top property. Fuck, I fucked up and said Yellow Jack. That was my bad. Ace Liquor owner says top property isn't owned by them. You must contact 356 and ask for Janet. She owns the top property. I am fucking working it for him, dude. Oh, this would be so much fun if someone did this for me on the reciprocal side. Like, and we were detectives. That would be fucking a shit ton of fun. Left it up for interpretation. Pretty much up to them. Like, you gotta give them hints somewhere to help keep them on track because everything's not tangible. It's all in their mind. Uh, but they're doing a fantastic job without just, you know, like I said, referencing the whole CCTV, foot CCTV footage. And, like, just give me what happened immediately so I can arrest him. That's not how it works. Sometimes, yeah. But that's still not how it works. So they're going to need to apply for a warrant uh, with probable cause that that might be their guy. I'm going to do, um, no one answers the door at the top property of Ace Liquor. Door says contact Janet at 3564 rental property. Yeah, there we go. Seems legit. Yes, there it is. So it's Samil that's gonna do it. Samil, 360. Yes, speaking. Who might this be? <laughs> this is great. Oh, fuck, I'm working it so hard. I'm going to see what this uh, turns into. Oh no, I was just laid down and it was so perfect, dude. Fucking A. I can hear all the cops outside. There we go, he's laying back down. Actually, it looks pretty fucking legit. I'm going to lay the controller down. That way I don't fuck this up. Because I want it to be perfect. You know what I mean? Oh, this is great. This is actually a really good scene. I didn't think it was going to be this expanded and good. But this turned out to be something good. Hi, Janet. This is Detective Samil. LSPD. Do you own the property above the Ace Liquor? Fuck, I got to remember his three. Remember his thing. 360. Yes. I do. I have. Had many issues with the police and them searching the property unless you have a warrant or get a or get about it sorry can't 
keep putting myself out or out at the expense of others. <laughs> Shit! Three, six, eight, nine, Unless you have a warrant. Not going to come out there for nothing. <laughs> this is great. The bike's there, so technically they might have probable cause, but... Just because a bike's there doesn't mean that someone technically is held up inside. It just means he could have ditched it, and that's technically where the bike is. So, it's just one of those things. They gotta find that evidence that they can apply for a search warrant um, and, and try to get into this building. You know what I mean? Okay, he asks, of course, ma'am, I understand. Do you know anyone by the name of Ronnie White? I'm gonna say no, but I'm writing out a recap. So I'll answer that in a second. Recap, you found tire tracks at the scene that were a possible match to the possible motorcycle. You stopped on Joshua. Locals at Stab City say they saw a man in a vest leaving the scene of a shooting at Stab City. He had some sort of helmet on. They didn't make out a make out a bike color except it was a chopper style with long handle bars gonna give him something here long handle bars ask manager vase or grievous has permission to the back of business and drop the bike off and i'm gonna do owner of ace liquor isn't aware of any male that drop a bike off and then 360 no doesn't ring a bell I am a property manager trying to sell the building police get a warrant and I let you in. Fuck. I'm gonna go just to be nice. I say that because selling the place is hard with all these cops around all the time. <laughs> like... I am fucking working them! Officers go to judge and get a warrant. It is approved, given all evidence. Judge asks on what grounds do you believe that the suspect is inside said property? Warrant on stand by till more evidence I'm gonna do a warrant on stand by I want I need to figure out how I can make it a little more tricky instead of I'm just going uh, gives officer goes to judge and gets a warrant is it approved? Like, what the fuck? That's- I did all this just for you to go and gives all evidence? Come on, motherfucker.
evidence may uh suspect is inside the house he granted a arrest warrant for suspect but needs further on a house on a search warrant to property not related to suspect. I'm trying to make it fucking difficult for him because I don't want it to just be silver platter shit. I know they got enough cops outside to fucking make everyone quiver, so at least work it a little more. You're going to find the dude sleeping anyways. I'm going to try to see if they could just find one more piece of evidence that might tie. They need to look at that bike. They need to look at that bike. <laughs> Emote impatient. There it is. He suggests taking a second look at the bike if you found it and where it is parked. If it's on the property, then that allows them the right to insinuate that the suspect might be held up in that property. Judge calls officer and on scene and asks if the bike is on the ace liquor property. Okay, that's probable cause, I guess. Judge gives clearance for search warrant on Ace Liquor property due to a possible suspect being All right, here he goes. Now they're going to start moving in. I'm going to just stay asleep. They're probably going to try to announce themselves, too, because they're going to have to clear the building. Oh, here they go. Watch him not even see me. Fucking A. Oh, immediately sees me. Well, Santos Police Department, make yourself known. I don't know if that's how you spell spell Wake snoring. Well, what, 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 what the fuck you guys want? Shit. What? What did I do? Just stand up for me. Show me your hand. What is all this about? Losantos, I didn't do anything. I don't even live here. Becky said I could sleep here. Who's Becky? I don't know. Some bitch named Becky. Come out here and face the wall once you come out. What wall? Who's who's talking? You? Who's talking? 
Right here. Okay. Yeah, I mean, I got some. You got any weapons on your person? Yeah, I got some on me. Okay, well, don't reach for nothing, okay? I ain't reaching. I was sleeping, man. I don't know what's going on. Oh, you don't got a name on me? There you go. See, it doesn't have to always lead to a shootout. That was actually fun. That was a pretty in-depth roleplay. You got go anything on you to stick that poke me? I mean, I like I like I told that guy. I got some. I got some guns on me. That's uh, and a knife. Other miss gave me. If you want to check that back room he was in, see if you find anything. Fuck! I can't drop up. <laughs> Uh, let's do slash me finds uh sod off shotgun high caliber pistol let's get this helmet and off. a knife. God damn it! I have to take this fucking helmet off so much it's not even funny. Who did you say it was that allowed you to stay here? Oh, I could have just did remove here. helmet. I don't know, some yeah, some chick named Becky. Over. Becky? What is she, does she own this place? I I don't know. You'd have to ask her. Okay, well guess what? We talked to the person that owns this upstairs building right here. Her name's not Becky. Well, I don't know what she told me. Her name was Becky. I can't tell you if she lied to me. I don't know. Not my problem if she's a liar. I'm gonna go look at these, these guns real quick. See if they match. Alright. Hey, did we, um, we search this guy for an ID or something? No. Alright. Let, let's search him, see if he's got here. a wallet on him. Here's his wallet right here. Okay, what's the, what's the name? Alright. Uh, let's see, match color pistol, is it used at the same, same caliber, technically all this is circumstantial, circumstantial, right, so, this so. Caliber on this pistol right here, so they'll have to hand it over to the court, the, the caliber used how does he still have a fucking pistol in his hand? Okay, what was the name on the ID he had on him? Ronnie White. Oh, oh, Mr. Right. White. We got bad news for you, my man. We have an, uh, an arrest warrant for you. Alright, well. And I'll... I want my lawyer, because I don't know what the fuck y'all talking about. Okay, yeah, we'll take care of all that. Okay. Alright, Mr. Uh, Mr. White, if you want to go ahead and follow us out of here, we'll explain everything once we get down there. Alright. Surprised none of them just grabbed me. Yet I have a arrest warrant. Well, just fucking grab me. I'm nice. surprised all no right, one just grabs me, but all right, no, no work. I don't think you're gonna go anywhere, Mr. White. No, but just speeds the process along a little easier. Is that your bike back there, Mr. White? Uh, might be. Oh shit, I don't know how I did that. Oh, Mr. White, it's in your best interest to go ahead and tell us the truth now, I promise you that. Well, like I said, I'm saving it for the lawyers, so... No one even read me my rights. Well, how did you know I was about to do that? I don't At know. At this time, Mr. White, you have the right to remain silent. Anything you say or do can be used against you in a court of law. You have the right to an attorney. If you cannot afford an attorney, one will be provided for you by the great state of San Andreas. Do you understand these rights as I read them to you? I do, and I want my lawyer. Alright, with these rights in mind, do you wish to ask us any questions? I do not. 
All right, sir. Playing hard to get. They have the evidence they need. That's all that matters at this point. Fuck, <laughs> like... Oh, shit. They were out we there for the a guy, good uh, minute, too. I got a good for little the, nap. Uh, arrest warrant that's out for him. And a uh, possible connection with the uh, murder. They have the enough evidence. Back. We're going to continue the investigation on that. Most likely going to connect him with that, so we'll let you know. Alright, where do you want me to take him? Same as Sandy for now. And, uh, investigation didn't take long, and, uh, we'll get back to him. Alright. What they could do is they could just add it to the, uh, my file anyways. Yeah, they had a shit ton of unmarked. It wasn't even funny. So pretty much if the gun matches the actual bullet, then they're good. But it would be nice if they took it back to the crime lab instead of just doing like a fucking quick field test on it with the microscope somehow on the back of their vehicle. But nonetheless, that was pretty in-depth roleplay. We've been in here for almost two hours. All right, well, since they pretty much have it here, I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up because it's going to be just them kind of just wrapping up the loose ends so that way they can actually get me into the system. So this is going to be where I wrap it up. But this one was a fun one, a lot more in-depth than usual, but I like it. It was fun and interesting. Probably really... In oh, that had to hurt. Probably really enjoyable for the detectives. The they got uh, something good. Yeah, exactly. 10 seconds for suspicion of murder. So... They uh, got a little bit of uh, actual stuff they got to do instead of it just being checking CCT CCTV footage um, and it just being nothing. So, I think it's cuff me, right? I forgot to uncuff me, which is, you're supposed to uncuff him before technically you put him in jail, but you can just do slash cuff me. But anyway, thank you all so much for coming out and watching another episode of DOJRP and we will see you next video.